A Southern Minnesota family is embracing the cold in a creative, vibrant way. The Thorson family made this giant igloo in their front yard. David Schumann takes us to Owatonna, where they have mixed frozen art and fun. Don't mind all the shatters if you see. What kid wouldn't love this in their front yard? And what kid wouldn't love to have parents like Ashley and Ryan Thorson? To keep three boys occupied and entertained um, takes some creative doing sometimes. More than 12 hours of construction, four days of work. You get about two thirds of the way through and you don't want to do it anymore, but you're way too invested, so you kind of have to finish. A few nervous moments when it came time to curve in the roof. You can't just stack it up into an egg wheel. It'll just fall all down. I was holding it up, and she was going in one hand on the bottom side, one on the top side. The idea was born out of a canceled vacation that created some downtime. Then it was just a matter of freezing lots of water tinted with food coloring in aluminum trays and packing the ice blocks together with snow. We only had one wall fall down when we were about five rows up, but since then, since it was nice and warm, it kind of melted, and now it's actually pretty solid. The Thorson estimate more than 250 blocks of ice are holding the igloo upright. Pictures don't even do this thing justice. These blocks are solid ice and I'm six foot four and I can practically stand up straight on the inside. Neighborhood celebrity status is what you get when you build something so impressive. And hopefully it brings as many smiles to other people as it has our family. In Owatonna, David Schumann, WCCO 4 News. I love it. Super right? cool. Yeah, yeah Ashley, it's awesome. Ashley sent us the photos of the igloo, and you can always share your winter fun photos with us too. Just use the hashtag WCCO on social media and let me show your picture on the air. Yeah, I hope it doesn't melt tomorrow, Chris. Now, well, it will a little bit, but then it's going to get so cold that thing will be up in April. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say that. No, I'm just kidding, Rob.